It's 4 o'clock. The last time I recorded was after 12.30. It was like close to 1. I was gonna go back to bed, but my apartment is a mess. This entire kitchen counter island is full of food. And my coffee table, a mess. The floor, a mess. And I was just on cleaning mode. As you'll see in this video, I just cleaned everything before i wanted to show the entire apartment tour i'll also include how i built my furniture so i bought a dresser from ikea i also bought the coffee table from ikea and i had to assemble it all by myself which girls rule i could i did it all by myself within a couple hours and that was fun here it is finally i think what is, it? what is it? Five months later, here is my official apartment tour. And without further ado, here is my apartment. Hello. <laughs> um, so I just got back from Ikea and I ended up getting my coffee table and a dresser finally. So I have more storage. I did also buy this pillow for the sofa and then there's like an accent cover like there's an accent pillow cover that i got so nothing better to do right now other than build this i am going to hopefully get it on the first try and not mess this up enjoy this time lapse of me building my stuff Okay, so I am finally going to do an apartment tour, long awaited, I know. And then I also decided to do a video voiceover just because I haven't talked to the camera in a really long time. And then I also will mention some big news at the end of this video. I had to make a really, really big decision. Uh, decision, oh my gosh. But let's get into it. As you can see, I replayed my empty apartment when I first arrived. And then this is my entrance hallway. Oh, there's me, hello. <laughs> right to the right side is the shoe closet. I'm trying to maximize as much as I can. And then I also put miscellaneous storage in there as well. The next door, hanging clothes wise was really limited. So I had to get an extra set of drawers as you can see on the bottom there. And then the kitchen is right there. I was very lucky with my apartment of how spacious it is, especially with this counter island right here. Most apartments in this building don't have it. The kitchen and sink and stove and wash, everything is literally against the wall. And then it's closed with a like wardrobe cover. So you would never guess that there is that behind. 
then all of these drawers are also kind of spread out miscellaneous wise I don't have any set things for each cabinet and then I was also lucky with my bathroom because the glass door it's also not common to have that in Korean bathrooms the shower head is literally above the sink so the water just gets everywhere and then my actual bedroom living room whatever room you would call this is very spacious so I was able to buy a coffee table, couch, that dresser, even the standing wardrobe. And then my window view is also amazing. It's just the front street and it, it's really nice. I get the sun throughout the entire day and I, I literally cannot complain. And then there's my little plants. I don't know how they're still alive, to be honest. And then my family photo, my grandparents, and of course, the famous Polaroid wall. Um, if you made it on my wall, feel blessed. <laughs> but that's pretty much it. But the big announcement that I have is I did quit my job.